Now that our faucet is installed, you can download the Sloan app here that says Sloan Connect. Once you download the Sloan Connect app, this will allow you to change settings in the faucet as well as some other functions that I'll show you now. Get started. You basically wave your hand in front of the faucet. It'll start to spray and then your faucet will come up and says connect to this faucet. And basically all you do is just click on it. The faucet will actually spray to let you know that it is connected. As you can see here, some of the features will tell you about your battery life, how many gallons of water usage, what type of activa activation mode is in it, flush line, I'll get to that in a minute, confirm your flow rate and your sensor range. So the first thing we're gonna do is take a look at the activation mode. It's a 30 second activation. You can have it on demand or metered. We're gonna change this to metered. We're gonna change it to a 15 second metered runtime and press done. Done again. As you can see, it's highlighted in this orange color. It will not set the faucet until you confirm it. And where do you confirm it? Right here where it says apply settings. What will happen, it'll actually run twice to confirm that that change has been made to this faucet. Some of the other features with this is you have the line flush for buildings that may not be used over the weekend. You can actually have these run a line flush um, anytime, seconds, minutes, every eight hours, every 10 hours. You can pretty much change it, whatever you want with that. The other big thing is, is that you can also do a diagnostic test with this. You click on diagnostic. Basically it tells you to place your hand in front of the faucet for at least three seconds. So as you can see, the diagnostic came up. I've run this a couple of times. As you can see, it's got green. The sensor is good. The solenoid is good. This faucet does not have a turbine, which you'll see in the different types of faucets you can get um, at the end of this video. Batteries at 100%. Now, if there was an issue with one of these, there would be a red X there. You can actually take this and send this report right over to Sloan and then call the number. They will be able to help you walk through any of the issues that you may have. If you want to give it a shot and troubleshoot, there's a whole tutorial here that comes up about this faucet and all the different styles that these faucets come in. Details will come up. We'll give you the Sloan model number, hardware number, firmware, everything right here. Also, you can disconnect if you need to, and then you can also view additional details when this was installed and right through. Sensor range, you can make it as you get closer you want it to turn on or farther away. Again, once you confirm, it's gonna come up in this orange, will not confirm with the faucet until you press apply. Then the faucet will run twice, once, twice. It will always run twice to confirm that everything was accepted. We want to go back to metered to on demand. We'll put it at 25 seconds, done, done, apply settings, and you'll see the faucet come on twice to confirm. Also, there's a help button here that you can go in, ask any support is in here as well. And you'll see with the different types of faucets that we do have with this, you can get different styles and different configurations as well with the mixing valves as well as your power sources. Hopefully this will help you guys see that this faucet is a very simple and easy faucet to install. Thank you.